emergency broadcast. We're sorry. All circuits are busy now. Will you please try your call again? Hello YouTube and Preppers, this is Decoms Prepper with a follow-up video to my EMP proof test equipment video that I made yesterday. In that video I talked about replacing all the vacuum tubes in the unit, but I'm also going to replace some of the capacitors and I figured I'd make a video to actually show you what happens to old capacitors and older equipment. So if you're looking at older equipment, you want to actually check those capacitors in that unit before you apply power to it. So here we have two caps that come right off the AC main line here. Uh, this is actually the fuse for the AC main. And yesterday I replaced this cord with a three prong cord. But if you look at this capacitor, as I scrape my screwdriver across it, the dielectric in the capacitor itself, the material between the plates, is actually oozing out through the paper. So this capacitor is pretty well shot. I'll scrape this one over here, and you can see all the goo coming off there, and I'll try to zoom in here so you can actually see that. There we go, get in a little tighter there. And you can just see all that gooey stuff. And that's actually coming out from inside the capacitor. So this capacitor is pretty well shot. So we're gonna go ahead and replace that capacitor. I ordered some online and they came in. And we got some nice capacitors here. So we'll go ahead and pause here. I'll get the soldering iron out, take these out, and install the new ones, and we'll show you what it looks like with new capacitors in there. I'll be right back. All right, guys, a half hour later, but we got them in. There's the two new capacitors right there. And I'm probably gonna do the rest of them on the bottom side here. While they're not as leaky as those other ones, I can tell that they're not quite 100%. So while I've got the box open, I'll go ahead and start changing those capacitors out and we'll try to zoom in here for you. That was zoomed in, get a little tighter. And those are the two new caps. And as you can see, there's other capacitors in this unit that are gonna also have to be changed out, like these two over here. I'll get on the eBay tonight and see if I can pick some of those up. And we'll go ahead and replace all those caps on the bottom side here and any other resistors that need to be changed. And we'll go ahead and change any other components that need to be replaced. And before I wrap this video up, I wanted to remind everybody that I still have the 8,000 subscriber contest going. So if you're interested in winning the two radios or getting a comms prepper patch, let's see if I can get one of those in frame, uh, please go ahead and submit a video response. It's about three videos back and you can see it in my list. And as always, thank you for watching my videos and subscribing to my channel. This has been the comms prepper with a EMP proof test equipment update and replacing some capacitors. Bye guys.